this elevator's got power. Monorail might too. That's the idea. We got customers! Tell them about today's special, Bucky! yourself useful and open that train! Understood. Quit barking. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> 
reinforcements inbound. Where? To the left. Monkey shit. Nightmare! What the hell operation were you sacks running down here? It's complicated. I needed to assess the severity of the situation. Establish a green zone. Look, not to be a dick here, but if your entire squad couldn't hold off these geeks, final echo ain't for shit. Skulls and creeps, yeah. We had them locked down. They're far from the worst thing down here. Oh, really? Well, tell me, sister, what is? We called them burnouts. Fully mutated. When we see one, no. Oh, awesome. Super duper. Color me jubilant. We are a target in this thing. Crash resistant. We'll be bulletproof too. I hope so. I'm picking up movement out there. Ha! <laughs> you see that? Fortunately, I did. Beat the burnouts. Holy fuck! Hold your fire! can get through this shell. No, it's snapping the cable! Oh, oh. 
on the fritz.
Pirate's Badge of Honor. Starring me! The place is built like crap. Old buildings falling apart. No. Something caused that. Something big. Trishka, any ideas? Got a hunch. Internal logic indicates a low probability of survival. That, uh, fucking computer in your skull? It's some antidepressants. It's jammed. Can you get us out of here, Gray? Careful, that almost sounded friendly. There's that labored hostility. A little forced. Just barely masking your lust, mademoiselle. Right. Very good. What <sighs> girl wouldn't fall for the crusty pirate who stranded her in hell? When does your jump ship arrive? I lost communications with Kingdom Terminal when I lost my leash. They don't know I'm alive. But the guy in the capsule. If he's alive, maybe you should call him on my leash. Can't. Your leash was compromised after it bonded to you. It won't send communications out. If he's alive, there's an evac en route to lift him out. If he dies, it'll be cancelled. Simple as that. Ah, speak of the devil. No combat signatures. There's a lot. It's only against the party of skulls. For now. Still hope. Wait! Ah! Ah, damn it. Help me down. We do not need her anymore. Yeah, but that don't make leaving her right. It wasn't too long ago you would have seen that. Ethics lesson gray. Things have changed. Oh, nice. So you're giving up. Letting that computer take over? Fine. Go. I'm about done listening to you whine anyway. Be warned, Serrano is under my protection. You try to assassinate him. 
I will not hesitate to deal with you. Deal with me? I'll deal with you, robot head jerk ass. Come on, girl. Don't check out now. You really need a breath mint. I heard what you said. All of this. You caused all of this to settle some score with Serrano? After all he's done, hell yeah. I'd do anything to kill that festering pile of shit. Why? Blood on his hands. More blood than you'd believe. Coming from you. Your band of scumbags murdered children. Uh, that's what Serrano told you. So what? I'm supposed to take the word of a mutineer pirate? You know why Dead Echo abandoned Serrano? Serrano tried to use us to do some ugly shit. Tried to use us to murder civilians, political rivals, reporters, witnesses. What did you say? Reporters? You're saying Serrano killed reporters? Yeah, at least one I know of. A guy named Novak. Bullshit! How would you know that? Novak? Why, do you know him? My father was killed by Separatists! The entire goddamn reason I joined the Corps was to root out the Separatist sons of bitches who assassinated him! If you know who did it, if you know who carried out the hit, tell me right fucking now! I don't know who did the work, but Serrano ordered it. You're a goddamn liar! How else would I know the name Novak, huh? We uncovered all Serrano's files. Your old man, he was one of the reasons we split from Serrano. If you're lying, I'll tear your fucking throat out. If you are lying, I swear to God, I will kill you. Slowly. Painfully. You will wish you died in that crash. Let's have words with the good general. I don't do follow so well. Right. Old dogs can't learn new tricks. Hey, I'm not that old. I don't like these close quarters. Is that fear in your voice, Barbara? No. Hell no! Oh, oh, that stench! Yeah, getting worse as we go. Damn! I mean, look at that! Burn out feeding grounds. Gee, 
Feeling like I should make some sort of witty comment here. Why start now? You smell that? Yeah. Fresh air. We're almost out. <sighs> You're welcome. You're such an idiot. <laughs>
Yum! Blister juice! Yeah.
face him. General fuckhead. Awful damn kind to of you to aid Triska in my rescue. Triska, please show this mutinous pile of excrement our appreciation. We have something to straighten out first. Did you kill my father? I know fuck all about your father. Grayson here, he's manipulated you. Tell her the truth. Put the gun down. You're kidding me. I am not. Your righteous indignation has cost me enough. Serrano will have an evac jump ship coming for him. I will be on board, <laughs> as you promised me. <laughs> Looks like I got a new best friend. All right, Ishii. Promise is a promise. I am wholly uninterested in whatever bullshit you people have to resolve. If either of you had a hand in the death of my father, I'll die happy knowing I took you both with me. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. I see we're all a bit upset. I see that. But friends, we got bigger fish to fry right now. The corporation that built this putrid mistake resort has commissioned me, at great cost, to detonate a DNA bomb that will dissolve all life, while leaving the city perfectly intact, allowing said corporation to come in and rebuild. Maybe not the best time to bore us with your mission deets. Well now, hold your dick for one second, you fungal rim job. This DNA bomb is set to detonate in two hours. My rescue squad won't arrive with a jump ship for three hours. Now, can you halfwits do the math and see the problem we face? He's telling the truth. No! no! Ah! Son of a bitch! <laughs> Think for a second, boy. You kill me, no jump ship home. You both die. How I see it, I did you a favor. She would have discovered your dead Echo Squad where the folks done killed her old man. <laughs> Come on, you dandy tarts. Gamma Storm's a brewing. So, if you pus dicks want to live past the next couple hours, we need to get cover. Get to making our way out to the Ulysses and deactivate that bomb. Be sensible. We can still get out of this alive. Don't know if I can live with sensible. Keep the pace! A lot of ground to cover before we hit the underground! Underground? <laughs> Only way to get through the storm! Worker entrances to the underground are everywhere. Nearest is in the next building over. Take the bridge. Who was working under the city that they needed so many entrances? I'll catch you up on a need-to-know basis.
assume whatever is down there is a good deal worse than what we've seen up here. Don't get your panties in a knot, Diana. I trained you better than that. What, more takers? Let's go! Heavy resistance. Lucky for you, there's a Confederate sanctioned general keeping you safe. Oh, and here I thought we were stuck with a psychopathic war criminal who needs his mouth washed out. <laughs> Who's gonna do the washing, boy? You? Just let me load myself. Gamma radiation, the cause of the mutations on Mars. Fucking tour guide? Them slanty devil eyes of yours don't see so good, huh? Another racial slur, and I will hurl you into that yeah! storm. Ah. Oh. Weak bluff, you prancing geisha.
could anyone be so irresponsible to build a city amid these storms? Radiation filters were destroyed during the workers' revolt. Bunch of pico commie socialist queers felt they weren't being treated fairly. Day later, the entire fucking joint's wrecked. Radiation leaking through the cracks. Two little babies back in Papa's care. <laughs> Don't you fret. Daddy'll get you out of this scary place. Right now, I'm torn between getting off this rock and stomping your brains out. Keep yammering. That choice gets a lot easier to make. Rishi here is highly motivated towards survival. You go ahead, take a poke at me, and we'll find out where his true loyalty lies. Joy, no other choice. Roll the dice. Take the elevator down to the garage. Oh, great. Workers. That just another name for slaves? Slaves? Ha! Bunch of convicts and reprobates given a second chance. They ran the city, down in the tunnels, in exchange for a shorter sentence. 
This here is what you get when you show a bit of leniency to fuck-offs. So they populated the underside of the city with convicts. Brilliant. Ain't nothing here. It's down the way. Found it! You want a trophy? Get in gear! We're about to march headlong into the shit! Big enough for a thousand inmates. Twenty-eight thousand, to be precise. So what's with the toxic waste? Byproduct of the city's gamma filters. Officials stored it down here while they dug up the hills for a place to bury it. Mean shit in those hills. Yeah, well, the yard birds were getting sick, dying, mutating, and what have you. So the goofball, miscreant ball tuggers decide to rise up and demolish the gamma filters. No more filters, no more waste. Nothing to protect from the storms. Convicts didn't think that far ahead. What remains down here? Ooh, big titty blowjob models with yellow fever. How fuck do I know? 